So today I just want to share with you what I'm using right now in the winter and some of my routine and rituals. I want to thank the sponsor of this video, Ritual. Uh, you may know their multivitamin and I also use their protein, but they now have a three-in-one prebiotic, probiotic, and postbiotic to support gut digestion and immune health. I definitely like to take a probiotic and this once daily capsule is essenced with mint. I love, love that about their supplements and it's delayed release capsule to reach the colon, not the stomach, which is where the probiotics can survive and grow. These don't need to be refrigerated and Ritual is known for their clean formula and their transparency. You can go on their website and you can trace all the labeled ingredients, the supplier, and also their environmental impact. Ritual is offering 20% off your first month using my code RACHELT20, 20% off during your first month if you go to ritual.com slash RACHELT20 and use code RACHEL20 at the checkout. One thing I really look forward to, especially when it's cold outside, is just taking a nice hot shower, turning on the diffuser in the bathroom, just, you know, lighting some candles, creating a vibe. And I am a tried and true Bondi Boost girl. I've been using Bondi Boost shampoo and conditioner and their mask for almost two years now. Um, I'm using it with this keratin scalp, um, I guess it's just a scalp tool, which I don't think is that much different than using your fingers, but I have one of those and it came with this scalp scrub. And I really like this scalp scrub. It's the only one I've ever tried from this brand called Keratin. And I expected a scalp scrub to be sort of like hard to get out of your hair, but this one's really nice. I really, really like it. And so I've been using it consistently as a part of my routine. I am trying to grow my hair out again. I'm just like, I can never make up my mind with my hair. I got out of the shower and I painted my nails while my hair was drying a bit. And I'm using this color called Under the Tree by Sally Hansen. I'm trying to take a break from blow drying my hair. So I'm gonna braid my hair, but first I'm spraying this intensive spray just around my crown it does really help those little baby hairs grow back in and it doesn't have any weird smell or it doesn't even really tingle or anything but it does work um, from what i've noticed from using it consistently and then i got this indian healing clay it's a deep pore cleansing mask you get a lot of product this was about ten dollars at walmart but you can find it at health food stores uh, you can buy it online and all you have to do is add a little bit of water since I prefer to do hydrating masks in the winter, especially now I am noticing my skin's pretty dry, um, I'm gonna do this first just to cleanse my skin, do a nice deep cleanse, and then I'm gonna do a hydrating sheet mask after that. So I'm gonna do a little bit of like a double mask today, a little bit of mask layering, if you will. Um, but this is really, you can feel the tingle and it definitely dries and sort of um, firms up the skin. And I always notice a huge difference after using it. So I love these clay masks and I always try to keep one around. I was using the blue clay for a long time, but I actually think I might like this one better. I picked up this Burt's Bees hydrating sheet mask that I wanted to try on my skin. I've never tried this particular one before, so I was excited to try it. It's basically like a serum infused mask. So I'm gonna use that. I usually let that sit on for about 15, 20 minutes and then bring the serum down to my neck and decollete. And then I'm definitely a big fan of using a hyaluronic acid serum. Of course, I talk about these products all the time on my channel. I mean, I'm pretty consistent with the things I like. I try to stick with what I like. So with my gua sha and my hyaluronic acid serum, I'm trying to be more consistent with those two things. And I definitely notice that that does keep my skin hydrated. Revitalash sent me a package in the mail with their eyelash serum and eyebrow conditioner. They recently changed their formula um, and I've used it in the past and it works great. So I'm really excited to see the results in a few weeks. I'm gonna put an intensive balm on my lips. This one's from Fleur and B. It's their One Lip Wonder. And then I'm also gonna be finishing up my Hawaiian body cream. This is definitely more of a summer cream, but I just wanna finish it up before I order something new, and I do really love the smell. So, and it's really hydrating and moisturizing for the body. So I'm gonna slather my body in that. I'm gonna take my three-in-one probiotic and my multivitamin right now, 
In the morning, I have been putting two scoops of collagen in my coffee or my tea. And then I'm going to fix my bed and I'm going to start journaling. And I've been trying to journal every single morning. Some days I miss it, but I just pop back in if I forget. And it's been great. I've really, really been enjoying journaling. And like I said in a previous video, I usually was a bullet journaler, like a goal maker. So now I'm doing basically just what I'm thinking. It's like a stream of thought and just writing it out in three pages. And I'm following the exercises listed in The Artist's Way, the book. And it's been really interesting and I really like it. I, I never realized how important it is to journal. Um, so now I get it and it's a huge part of my routine. And so I'm gonna try to be really consistent with that as well. I'm very excited because our local YMCA is having like a no sign up fee coming on December 19th. So I'm gonna sign up to the YMCA and they have a 5K coming up in the spring, which I really wanna do and just like start doing classes. But in the meantime, I've been doing at-home workouts and I do a combination of different things and just try to stay as consistent as possible. I'm actually on my period right now, so it's very important that I perform these like routines, the stretches and everything that I need because I really do feel it in my body. Those days leading up to my cycle are just really hard. Um, and so yeah, it's just really good to stretch and just, after a nice hot shower and just after a little self-care, it was just so, so needed. So after my hair has a chance to dry naturally inside, I finish up my stretching, I'm gonna go for a walk. Even when it's really cold outside, like I just genuinely enjoy taking the dogs for a walk because it's it's really nice to get out and just experience the, the time in nature. It's very grounding, it's very healing, and I, I thoroughly enjoy it so I'm gonna go for a walk and yeah that was a little bit of time to just tune inward to focus on some self-care and yeah that completes my winter self-care and what I'm using right now I hope you enjoyed this video and be sure to use the code if you want to try out rituals 3-in-1 probiotic and uh, yeah I'll see you very soon in the next video Bye.